Hi students, in the 12th standard, we have volume 1, top students, average and slow learners. So, we have a common question, portrugal, important questions. So, we have double tick slow learners, double tick plus single tick average students, full questions on the top students. So, listen, lesson 1 electrostatic, 5 marks. Question number 1. Explain in detail the construction and working of a Van de Graaff generator. Question number 2. Calculate the electric field due to an electric dipole on its axial line. Question number 3. Calculate the electric field due to an electric dipole on its equatorial line. Question number 4. Derive an expression for electrostatic potential due to an electric dipole and explain its special cases. Question number 5. Obtain the expression for electric field due to an infinitely long charged wire. Question number 6. Obtain the expression for resultant capacitance when capacitors are connected in series and parallel. 3 marks. Question number 1. Derive an expression for electrostatic potential due to a point charge. Question number 2. Derive an expression for electrostatic potential energy of the dipole in a uniform electric field. Question number 3. Derive an expression for the torque experienced by a dipole due to a uniform electric field. Question number 4. What are the differences between Coulomb force and gravitational force? 5. Obtain an expression for energy stored in the parallel plate capacitor. 6. Obtain the expression for capacitance for a parallel plate capacitor. 7. Discuss the various properties of conductors in electrostatic equilibrium lesson 2 current electricity 5 marks 1 how the emf of two cells are compared using potentiometer 2 obtain the condition for bridge balance in wheatstone's bridge 3 explain the determination of the internal resistance of a cell using voltmeter and potentiometer so I the voltmeter is very important Question number 4. Explain the determination of unknown resistance using meter bridge. Question number 5. Describe the microscopic model of current and obtain general form of Ohm's law. 3 marks. Question number 1. Derive relation between current and drift velocity. 2. Explain the equivalent resistance of a series and parallel resistor network. 3. Explain about Thomson effect, Seebeck effect. For state and explain Kirchhoff's rules. Then lesson 3 Magnetism and Magnetic Effect of Electric Current. 5 marks. 1. Discuss the working of limitations of a cyclotron in detail. 2. Calculate the magnetic induction at a point on the axial line of a bar magnet. 3. Calculate the magnetic induction at a point on the equatorial line of a bar magnet. 4. Explain the principle and the working of a moving coil galvanometer. 5. Obtain a relation for the magnetic induction at a point along the axis of a circular coil carrying current. 6. Find the magnetic induction due to a long straight conductor using ambient circuit law. 7. Find the magnetic induction at a point due to an infinitely long straight long straight conductor carrying current 3 marks 1. Discuss the conversion of galvanometer into an ammeter and a voltmeter 2. Compare the dia, para and ferromagnetism 3. Compute the torque experienced by a magnetic needle in a uniform magnetic field 4. Discuss its magnetic field in detail. 5. State and explain Biot's Savart law. Lesson 4. Electromagnetic induction and AC. 5 mark. Question number 1. Show mathematically that the rotation of a coil in a magnetic field over one rotation induces an alternating EMF of one cycle. This is nothing but orientation of the coil. Question number 2. Explain the construction and working of a transformer. 3. Explain the working of a single phase AC generator with the necessary diagram. 4. Derive an expression for phase angle between the applied voltage and current in a series RLC circuit. 5. Find out the phase relationship between 
voltage and current in a pure inductive circuit. 6. Give the uses of Foucault or eddy current. 3. Mark 1. Using Faraday's laws of electromagnetic induction, derive an equation of equation for motional EMF. 2. How will you induce an EMF by changing the area enclosed by the coil? 3. Show that Lenz law is in accordance with the law of conservation of energy. 4. Find out the phase relationship between voltage and current in a pure resistive circuit. 5. Mention the various energy losses in a transformer. Lesson 5. Electromagnetic waves. 5 mark 1. What is absorption spectra? Give their types. 2. What is emission spectra? Give their types. 3. Write down the properties of electromagnetic waves. 4. Explain the Maxwell's modification of ambient circuit law. 5. Write down Maxwell's equation in integral form. 3 mark. Write short note on microwave and x-ray. 2. Write short note on radio waves and visible spectrum.